Hey, welcome back to Ramsey Land. Today we're gonna to make mercury iodide. Check this out. So all I'm using in this lab is mercury, potassium iodide, nitric acid, a beaker, a graduated cylinder, and a dropper. The first step is to add 50 milliliters of nitric acid. I'm using 15 molar nitric acid in my beaker, and then I'm gonna add just a small amount of mercury to my nitric acid. And rather quickly, that'll start to react, and I'm gonna put it in my fume hood because this does create a little bit of nitrogen dioxide, which is kind of a brown gas that you'll see form. Okay, I'm gonna flip on my fume hood because you can start seeing some of that nitrogen dioxide gas coming off the nitric acid as the mercury begins to dissolve and the solution changes into mercury nitrate. The next step is to fill your graduated cylinder with 70 milliliters of distilled water and add four grams of potassium iodide and stir your solution until it's completely aqueous. Okay, at this point you can see that all of our mercury is dissolved in our nitric acid, making mercuric nitrate, and our aqueous solution of potassium iodide is ready. This is the double displacement reaction, which will create an insoluble precipitant, mercury iodide. Check this out. Oh, look at that. That is amazing. Look at all of that mercury nitrate that changed into mercury iodide. It's that red orange precipitant that you see there that fell so quickly. That's mercury iodide. Let's add just a little bit more. Oh, that is awesome. Check out that precipitation. Just amazing. That is awesome. Whoa. Okay, now in order to save my precipitant, my mercury iodide, I'm gonna decant some of it off the top into my beaker. And then I'm going to use vacuum filtration to collect the rest of it. Now I'm ready to use some filter paper for my vacuum pump. And I'm gonna put that here. And I like to add a little bit of water just to get a good seal and then I'm gonna pour the rest of my mercury iodide into my filter. And then I'm just gonna turn on the vacuum pump. And you can see that I'm gonna get uh, my mercury iodide. Okay, after I've washed my mercury iodide several times, I'm putting it into a Petri dish. I'm adding some desiccant to my desiccator and I'm gonna let it dry in here for several days. And then it'll be ready for some other experiments that I'd like to do with my mercury iodide. Isn't that amazing? Okay, so what's going on in this amazing reaction is, first we did a single displacement reaction where we put mercury with nitric acid and that created mercury nitrate or mercuric nitrate. Then when we added that with our potassium iodide solution, that became a double displacement precipitation reaction where your mercuric nitrate traded places with your potassium iodide. So these are our reactants, these are our products. So 
the mercuric nitrates traded places and became mercury iodide. That's the bright orange reddish precipitant that's insoluble that you saw. And the potassium iodide becomes potassium nitrate. Well, I hope you enjoyed today's edition of Ramsey Land, and I'll see you next time.